Hi, kindergarten. It's Mrs. Waco. It's Friday, March 27th, and it's story and journal time. So I have a new book today called The Berenstain Bears on the Moon, written and illustrated by Jan and, I'm sorry, Stan and Jan Berenstain. And I do think you've seen, um, maybe not this book, but other Berenstain Bear books in the kindergarten classroom. They're part of our Dr. Seuss series. Okay, so let's get on with this. The Berenstain Bears on the Moon. By Stan and Jan Berenstain. So think for a moment. Let's look at that picture on the cover and the title. What you think this book might be about. All right, got it? All right, let's begin. Here's a picture, okay? On the night before the bear's big day, they looked at the moon far, far away. Sounds like another rhyming book, right? We've got big day, far, far away, away and day are rhyming words. Then morning comes, today is the day, they will go to the moon far, far away. See that picture? This also has great illustrations. The crowd counts down, the rockets blast. They wave goodbye, they are off at last. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, blast off! And off they go. Two little bears and one little pup. They are off to the moon, going up, up, up. They look back down, but they can't find their treehouse home. They have left it all far behind. I'm going to read that again. I think I didn't do it justice. They look back down, but they can't find their treehouse home. They have left it far behind. Where is their town? It is hard to say. Their town is now far, far away. Now their feet no longer touch the ground. They are out in space. They float around. Two floating bears and their floating hound. Up ahead, it's a shower. It's a meteor shower. They will have to go through. Turn on more power. There's the little meteorites. Will they get to the moon? They will, they must. Their slogan is, to the moon or bust. Look who's way back here. Ah, the pup. Can you see my pup? There's my pup asleep on the bed. Behind them, the earth is now so small. It is nothing more than a small blue ball. The pup begins to wonder when his paws will touch the earth again. Oh, the pup looks a little worried. Then up ahead, it's there, the moon. Buckle up tight, we're landing soon. Landing, they are landing in a cloud of dust. They said they would, then they said they must. They made it to the moon and they didn't bust. Looks like a perfect landing. Down onto the old moon, they step with pride, two bears and a pup along for the ride. <laughs> Look at their, their protective astronaut gear with their little helmets and their suits. Even the dog has one. Now the bears have many things to do, but first they look around. They enjoy the view. Okay, I want you to think about what they have to do when they're on the moon because we're going to write about it later. 
Then they fly their flag. They take moon notes. They collect moon rocks in their moon rock totes. Okay, see what they're doing? Then they try some jumps high in the sky. Moon jumps almost make you fly. Hmm, that looks fun, like you're on a trampoline. Now it's time to get behind the wheel and explore the moon in their moon mobile. Oh, it looks like a like a dune buggy to take on the beach, huh? Look at that. That looks like fun. Two bears on the moon. They are all packed up, ready to go home now. So is their pup. Will their ship lift off? Will the rockets burn? Will the two little pups and their bear... I'm sorry. <laughs> Let me read this whole thing again. Two bears on the moon. They are all packed up, ready to go home now. So is their pup. Will their ship lift off? Will the rockets burn? Will the two little bears and their pups return? If the two little bears use all their skill, they will return. They will. They will. Two bears and their pup in their rocket ship on their way back home on their back to earth trip. Now they have a new slogan on their, on their uh, ship. It says, to the earth or bust. To their friends on the ground, to their house, safe and sound. Look at everybody so happy they're returning. Safe back on the earth, they step out of their ship. Wow, say the bears. That was quite a trip. The welcome home sign. I know there's another page. Ah. Now they look up at the stars very, very far away. Will they go up to a star? Well, they may someday. the end. Okay. Um, that was a nice book. Okay, that was a little bit longer than some of our other books. You see the title again? The Berenstein Bears on the Moon. So, for your journal, um, I want you to write two things uh, that the bears did on the moon. Two things that they saw on the moon. And um, so I want your sentence to be something like, the bears walked on the moon and collected moon rocks um, on the moon. Okay, so it starts with the bears, then you fill it in, and something on the moon. Okay, and I'll, I'll write it down on the captions. And so this is a fun one. It might take a little bit longer, but enjoy the writing and enjoy the pictures. And then if you have time, and you'd like to share. I love the pictures of your journals and um, the drawings that you post, okay? Um, you're doing such beautiful work. Have fun today. It's sunny, um, and um, have a good time with this, okay? I'll see you on Monday. Bye.